Hey everybody! It's Mike here coming to you from world famous Courtney Mazda. This is a little video for all you great people out there, all you wonderful people checking us out from the comfort of your own home. This is the all new, brand new, first time ever 2025 Mazda CX-50 Hybrid, baby. Check it out! 2025 CX-50 Hybrid in that wind churl, wind chill pearl paint. I love that paint. It really hides the scratches and the dirt really well. This one is brand new, so it has zero scratches and zero dirt on it. As you can see here, it comes with a nice set of 18, 19-inch rims and tires, four-wheel disc brake system. You got a mud and snow rating on those tires. And with the all-wheel drive system, you won't get stuck anywhere with these tires and and all-wheel drive system. Check out the back end. I love the look of this CX-50. The design is just awesome. It's very sculpted. You got these big fender arches. Got that really nice cladding down below the fenders and along the rocker panel. You got that little cutout at the back. Nice LED tail lights, tinted windows along the back. A really prestigious Courtney Mazda uh, sticker in the back window. It is the awesomest car we have right now, I gotta say. Check out the side profile, also really, really nice. The CX-50 Hybrid sits about an inch higher than the regular CX-50. It's got a bit more <coughs> cladding on it as well. You got these beautiful headlights that turn as you go around corners, automatic high beam, low beam, signal lamps built into the outside rear view mirrors. And it's got a camera underneath that mirror too for a 360 camera surround, sound, surround camera. You got a blind spot monitoring that shows up in the rear view mirror. The doors are touch sensitive, so you can lock the door by just simply swiping your finger along the little indentation. To unlock the door, you just grab the inside of the door handle and it'll open up that door. Check out that big panoramic roof. You got some roof rails there already, too. All you got to do is get the crossbars to go across there. You got all sorts of cameras and stuff like that for autonomous braking and lane departure warning systems. And uh, you got more more radar systems and behind the Mazda symbol there's another front camera you got park distance control more ventilation more vent cutouts up front here as well underneath the hood is a 2.5 liter naturally aspirated four-cylinder engine made it up to that hybrid system that thing produces about 219 horsepower tons of power almost as much power as the turbo for horsepower the turbo on regular gas gets about 220 horsepower of course if you put the premium fuel in there you get a bit more Check out the profile of this thing too. It looks really, really good. I love the sculpted fenders again and the, the, uh, the design that Mazda's come out with is absolutely fantastic. And these are all made down in Huntsville, Alabama. Brand new factory there in 2021. They uh, started building cars with uh, half the factory builds a Toyota Corolla Cross and the other half builds these. And they're using that, uh, there's that blind spot monitoring system turning on there. I don't know if you notice that. But yeah, this is uh, using that Toyota hybrid technology. It gets amazing fuel economy. You're gonna get about 30% better fuel economy if, in this vehicle than you would if it wasn't the hybrid system. It's averaging around six, a little over six liters for every 100 kilometers. In a vehicle this size with this kind of power, that is pretty tough to beat. It's fantastic. Check out the interior. You got that nice stitching along the door there, chrome handles. Uh, a little bit of uh, storage in the door as well. You got power seats. You got that that nice little rope, kind of like an orangey terracotta rope inside the seat, and then the stitching there as well. Perforated seats that you're looking at there, folks. It also has. Um, we're going to equip this one with some nice rubber floor mats inside the glove box here. You got lots of room for your for your owner's manual and everything like that. Lots of drive modes. There's your big center armrest. It fits everybody. You got a bit of storage in there as well. It's gonna pop that open like that. And uh, having owned having owned uh, having owned a CX-50 myself, I gotta say it's very comfortable. That's my favorite spot to be. Underneath the armrest here is a is a wireless charging system. That's your HMI commander, which is like a mouse for the screen up top here. You got your automatic transmission with a sport mode and multiple drive modes if you want to go off-roading or if you need a, a bit more of a uh, um, Vancouver style type driving a bit more aggressive you got your heated seats and ventilated seats and dual zone climate control here as well and then look at all the extra light that comes into the car with that big panoramic roof okay one of my favorite places is the back seat 
These are very spacious back here, very comfortable. Look how wide that door opens up. You can even be a big guy like me to get in and out, it's no big deal. So getting in out of the back here, very spacious. I got tons and tons of room. I uh, got some headroom, shoulder room. I can move around here quite easily. It definitely would be a good vehicle for a road trip. I've got an armrest with some cup holders here. I can put these seats down. It's got a 60-40 split rear folding seat. So if you want to get some bigger stuff back here, longer stuff. Um, and there's a tremendous amount of space in the back hatch as well. So uh, you can definitely fit your cooler in there with your dog crate and your two, lug two suitcases going on a road trip. I know you can do that because I've done it myself. Let's check out a couple other things here. You got some heated seats, USB-C ports, and ventilation for your rear passengers, and uh, very spacious. You got all the side airbags, it's very safe. You got uh, curtain airbags out of the ceiling, and there's the spot to be right there again, folks, right behind the steering wheel. This car is a lot of fun, especially when you're steering and handling and braking and riding and accelerating and all that fun stuff. Let's go look in the back hatch. By the way, it also has a Bose sound system, which is going to rock your socks off. Check out the back end of this thing. You got that nice dual exhaust off the back, more cameras, some more vent, uh, more LED lighting and rear windshield wipers. It's got the power lift gate on the back. Open says me. And then back here with my CX-50, I've got an old rubber. I added the rubber uh, tray back here. It goes up to the back of the seats as well, which keeps the... Uh, Keeps the area nice and clean. You got these quick releases if you want to put that seat down in a hurry. One for this side, one for that side. You got grocery hooks, more tie downs underneath. Here's your spare tire and tools. And check it out. They even give you a really nice subwoofer built right into the spare tire. And that's not just any old subwoofer. You know what that says? Bose. Really, really nice. There's a couple other things back here. Great all wheel drive system. Very fuel efficient. Close says me. I'm going to get behind the steering wheel here to tell you a little bit more about what that's like. And uh, so the seats memorized, the seats memorized to the keys. So you can have up to four different positions memorized for seating positions. Uh, two inside the vehicle and you get two keys with the vehicle. So you get one for each key as well. Uh, over here in my, on my outside rear view mirror, you'll see a little light come on. That's your blind spot monitoring system. And a rep that if you see a little bit of a, a frame around the glass in the rear view mirror, that means that's a tinting rear view mirror. So that will automatically tint for you, just like that mirror here will, if somebody's in your behind you and shining their bright lights at, you'll get a nice and tint on there for you. In front of my left knee, I've got your eye active safety sense features. I can turn some of the warnings off there. There's your 360 camera. When I push that 360 camera, it shows us what's around the vehicle right here. You got a few different uh, modes you can have that on. You got your park distance control. It'll beep as you get close to something. You got your traction control, and that's where you open the, the door for your gas, which you won't have to do very often. That's it is very, very fuel efficient. And then over down here, you got your memory seats and your, your, uh, your open and close your hatch. Here's your automatic headlights. Over here is your stereo controls for uh, voice command. You can you can do your Hey Google if you connect your phone up to Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. You got information which will change the cluster look a little bit here. Over here, it tells you when you're charging your hybrid system. Anytime you're not on the throttle or if you're hitting the brakes, that'll dip down into the charging spot. And then you then it'll tell you what kind of power you're using depending on where your throttle is. Over here, you got your fuel gauge and you got your temperature control. It tells you how many kilometers you have left in your tank. It gives you all sorts of EV uh, stuff as well. You, here's your cruise control, and it's a, an adaptive cruise control, which means it'll it'll match the speed of the driver in front of you if he's going slower than your desired speed. There's also a heads-up display. There's a little cutout here in the uh, dash. It pr produces an image in the windshield of your uh, posted speed limits, also your speed and your cruise control. It'll also give you navigation directions up there as well. And it does have factory nav. I'm not sure if the, if the SD card, yeah, there's your SD cards in there. But even better yet, if you got the Android Auto Apple CarPlay, you'll get your Google Maps going and all that kind of stuff. As soon as you put it into reverse, it shows you what's behind you with the backup camera. But over here on the, on the right is your 360 camera, kind of gets you lined in, up into that parking spot just perfectly. 
Uh, down below here, you got some more cup holders. There's your automatic transmission, multiple drive modes. You can have it in sport or power, normal, which is the most fuel efficient, and then trail, which would be like anytime you leave the road and you want a bit more slipperier situation, this is the best place to be. Last but not least, folks, let's try out the stereo system in here. Hopefully, they got something good playing on the local radio station. Nothing. Let's check out the next station. It is. Uh. Hey, it's me. Give a thing. No. I'm just saying. No. Oh yeah. That's it. Love is in the air, baby. That's the CX50 hybrid for sale here at Courtney Mazda. Come on down and get it. This is going to be the hottest vehicle in 2025. I know it is. Uh, great technology and uh, reasonably priced. Come on down to see me. Give me a call. 250-338-5777. Email me, mike at courtneymazda.com. And thank you very much for watching and have a great day.